yeah, feast your eyes on that sizzle right there in a cast iron pan, which look, we love cast iron for this very reason, that browning, crisping, the sear you can get. The way a cast iron pan holds heat, the way it, it adds flavor to your cooking, whether you are searing or frying or baking, but if you think about it, cast iron can be a little finicky in the past, right? I mean, you've got to worry about seasoning it, what type of sauces you're using, how do you clean it? So that is where Kitchen HQ comes into play here because we wanted to bring you everything you love about cooking with cast iron and get rid of all the bougie okay? All the things you hate to deal with because this cast iron pan is nonstick. You can wash it in the dishwasher if you want to. You will never have to season it at all. It is the easiest way to cook, to fry, to bake. You can put it into the oven as well, up to 500 degrees. And it's very, very easy to make you feel like a pro, whether you are or you aren't, because you no longer have to be intimidated when you use this. This is hefty, heavy duty. Any cooking surface it will work on. It's a 10 inch, comes with that great helper handle. You can see these beautiful colors that we have available and right before we get to that I want to show you this I'm actually really excited about this extra that we're including this is a trivet it's made of beech wood it's beautiful and we love trivets because they protect our surfaces when you're putting a hot pan down but what makes this one different I want you to see something we got some inspiration from a French um, enamel cast iron company who had something similar to this and we took it and made it even better because it's magnetic, which means, look at this. So you can go straight from the stovetop over to the table and never have to worry about that coming loose. So any of your magnetic pans, you're gonna love using this with, especially your brand new nonstick cast iron. Now take a look at the colors we have available. This is what makes it fun, and this makes it a great gift. We have this gorgeous teal that I was holding. This one is the taupe, which is a very restoration look, very, very pretty. We have your classic black. We have blue. This this is coral. When have you ever seen a coral cast iron skillet? Come on. We have the plum. We have silver. This is red. And at the bottom, we have rose. $39.95 is our price point today for that pan and also the magnetic trivet here. It's a $76 value, you guys. We have flex pay, so $13 and change. We'll get it home for you. And we have our extended holiday return period right now. So if you are getting this as a gift for someone else, you can hang on to it until the end of January next year and return it, no worries, if you need to. I'm really excited about this. We've got our expert, Mark Gill, here in the kitchen. Mark, it's good to see you. It's good to see you. You know, I was saying right before we started that uh -huh. I'm one of those, a novice in the kitchen, <laughs> I would call it, and I've always loved the idea of cooking with cast iron. Right. I was intimidated because you have to baby it so much. Well, the this seasoning the and the re-seasoning and knowing yes. what to put in it and not to put How in to it. clean uh, it. Uh, the release point, that's a big word when you're using cast iron. Yeah, I don't what know about that. What people love about non-stick cookware, the traditional stuff that we see now, that kind of launched in the 80s uh, when te uh, 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 cast iron wasn't looking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what it is? It's very forgiving. And that's yes. what we brought to our cast iron. We brought forgiving to our cast iron. In fact, have a look at this. Think of the food budget I have at this giant TV network, and I'm going to start with a 15 cent egg <laughs> because it's this egg that can embarrass even the most expensive cast iron pans out there, and that's right. what it's all about. So I'm going to set that there for a second. We've got a little bit frying. Have a look at the way I've decked out my steaks. You want some oh, of the best steaks in the world? This yes. is how your steak houses are going to do it. Now, you see this crust? Do you see this sear? That's the dimension of cooking that we lost when we switched to that non-stick stuff. But what we've got now is the ability, like the big restaurants with the big barbecue uh, like cook lines and everything Absolutely. to recreate that so I slid the butter off to the side now by the way our pans don't require any butter yes. or oil at all and if you have a look beside here at the pork loin that we have searing you just got it set right exactly on top. no butter no oil absolutely nothing and have a look when I talk about that dimension of cooking oh, there it yes. is and here's that why so good when this pan gets made mm -hmm. it's made in a sand mold and when it breaks away that sand leaves hills and valleys and dips and doodles and the natural sugars and the fats from foods fall right into there in cast iron and flash back up and that's what gives you ready for this Look at that, that crust that you have to have an effort to cut through with a knife. Nothing else but cast iron is going to do that for oh you. Oh, my goodness. And I love that when you're done, you could pop it right into the dishwasher if you want. This would be a headache <laughs> with a normal cast with iron. With anything, exactly. You'd be like, how gonna am I going to clean this up? crazy special with that. So let me okay. let that sit there for a second. Okay. I'm going to run over here just real quick because we've got a lunch rush. We have a I short know. presentation, so I want to share lots of food with you. How about this? How about... 
a black Angus pork belly pastrami burger, just like you'd have out on the grill. Ooh. So we're gonna get that going here. I just wanna get things cooking. But now, uh, uh, here's my favorite way okay. to make a steak. And one of the things that I wanna do is make sure that we share some tips with you here. So my steaks are just about done. I'm gonna take them off to rest for just a second. And this is gonna be my first opportunity to share with you that incredible trivet. So let me just let these rest for one second. Okay. Now, steaks are best when you finish them off with a sauce. And if you've ever worked with cast iron before, especially if you've got a grandma that's got the cast iron and watches you do this, a little bit of red wine in that pan, uh, and grandma's head's gonna come off her shoulders. And why would that typically be bad? Because all <laughs> because the seasoning you did. Of all of the acid that's in wine mm -hmm. or citrus, the second it hits that finish, no matter how long you've been working, maybe you've been working on that seasoning for years, the second it hits there, it rips it right off. Uh, and let's make it even worse, shall we? Okay. Let's put balsamic in there, <laughs> right? And just to thicken it up, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna add a little bit of roux, just like that. Now, one of the things that I do like to do for a little bit of color is add a little bit of asparagus oh, on the bottom. Yeah. Now, here's what I want you to do from here. I want you to take these steaks, and I want you to go ahead, and I want you to return them to the pan. Okay. All right? And then, watch what I'm gonna do, and oh. we're gonna come back and play with this cheese before I lose it. So guys, watch this. See that trivet up front that we keep talking about? For those of you that love to entertain, that love to have people over. Watch. Ready for this? You're gonna go ahead, Simply touch it, it's magnetic. Yay! Now you don't need a second hand, <laughs> now you don't need a helper, now you don't have to reach into that drawer and wonder where it's gonna come from. All you're gonna do is walk into the table and there is a perfect meal. And if you, you wanna see. It's the, the little <laughs> things, man. And this cheese, I'm watching it in my stomach. Oh, the pit in my stomach yet. keeps dropping and I'm thinking, Watch what are this. we gonna do about this? Remember, non-stick, so. Now, just prepare to be impressed. Here's yeah. a cool way to have a burrito maybe you haven't thought of before. Are you ready for this? I'm gonna pop it right there and we're gonna go ahead and oh. we're gonna wrap it just like that. Now, when you talk forgiveness and you talk nonstick, have you ever seen anything like that? Okay. And let's finish it off, because it's all about presentation. There we go. And a little bit of our red. Now you're speaking my language like here, Mark. And one of these, and that is such oh. a cool way to do it. And what it's all about is right here. And this okay. is what I really want you to see, guys. In 3,000 years, no one's been ever to say, able to say this. You ready? This is dishwasher safe, non-stick cast iron. That means that all of those things that you love about your either copper, titanium, whatever kind of non-stick you yeah. have, this does it. I love the, it. The beauty of this too is, it, I keep saying this because if you're in gifting mode like I am, because we're actually not far off from the holidays. No, you're not. This is such a great idea for even a new chef, a novice chef, someone who would love to cook and have those benefits of cast iron, but doesn't know all of the traditions like me or anybody else out there who doesn't know how you're supposed to season this, what sauces you can and can't use, right. how you can clean it. This gives you everything you love about that cast iron, but being able to treat it in a modern way. Exactly. Because exactly. you can dishwash it, because exactly. you can just use anything you want to cook in here, you can absolutely do. I love the colors too, by the way. Mm -hmm. That just adds a little bit of fun. We have teal and taupe and black and blue and coral, plum, silver, red, and pink for you to choose from. And it's a nice size. The 10 inch size, I think, is just perfect. Exactly. It's a great size for a family of, uh, you know, anywhere from four to six. And I want you to watch what I'm doing here. When we talk nonstick, in your life, you would never put the skin side or flesh side oh, of a cold salmon into a hot cast iron pan because that skin's gonna stick. You're gonna you'll constantly try and scratch right. at it. We're just gonna leave that there and let things happen. We've got our shrimp that's starting to uh, get all, oh, I love this. Ooh, look, 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 I'm gonna hold this sear. right there. <laughs> There's the dimension in cooking that we lost. There's the reason yeah. we go to restaurants. There's the reason people go to chef school to figure out how to do that. When you've got the right cookware, you can do it. It. Do you so have let's any go ahead. Um, tips on temperature, what works sure. well for this type of pan? Cast iron does not like super high heat on the stovetop. Now, okay. it's oven safe and heat safe up to 500, 550 degrees. And we kind of call it off there because we don't want you to hurt those pretty colors that are on the outside. Sure. But at the end of the day, it's cast iron. Right? Yeah, right? <laughs> cast iron was invented as a large cauldron to sit beside a giant fire uh. to withstand that heat. And what we did is we took the legs off squished it down yep. and called it a fry pan. <laughs> but this is 3,000 year old technology and for the first time we've brought it into today by offering you all of the non-stick properties. So let me go ahead and I'll just say maybe ask Tracy to grab this and pop it in the oven here because I'm out of space. But have a look here, okay? I've got a beautiful yep. bread pudding. Holiday time is really fantastic. I've got my trivet right here. Are you ready for this? I love it. 
and that's it. So no extra smart. hand, no extra help, no extra anything. You're going to walk this right to the table, right <laughs> to the Thanksgiving table, right to the Christmas table. And by the way, if you do have a budding chef, somebody who's really looking to get into it, man, this is the way to go. Because to your point, it's being able to offer that cookware that gives you those incredible results, but to have that forgiveness right. zone, that buffer with our non-stick properties and our ability to put in the dishwasher, and you never uh, have to season it. And you know what? We have this great cookbook, too, I wanted to mention while we have a chance. It's called the Southern Cast Iron Cookbook. A hundred different recipes wow. in here. So if you think about gifting this all together, this is $17.95. It's got everything from desserts to appetizers to entrees that you could possibly want. There's the info on your screen right over there. Um, we're going to take a look at our shrimp because I notice it's looking nice and crispy. You're adding Beautiful. your veggies now. A little steam there and to get it the, going. Did you just put broth in there? A little there? bit of beef that? broth in there just for happy. Then we're going to put some cooked noodles on top. We're going to let that steam. One pot One meal. pot meals yeah. are beautiful. Now let's go ahead. What do we want to do here? Ooh, 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 Are you a hot, spicy food fan? Yes, I am. All right. <laughs> One of the biggest trending foods right now is Nashville hot chicken. All right? Oh, yeah. This is beautiful. If you love heat, this is the way to go. So remember, this is a nice, deep, heavy 10 inch cast iron pan. So all of your frying, whether it's chicken or chicken fingers or the schnitzel we're gonna do here in a second, this is perfect for. Now, here comes the heat in Nashville hot chicken. If you okay. ever ordered it and wonder where it comes from, right in the flour that they use to dredge it with, they put a little bit of cayenne and a little bit of chili oil, just Ooh, to get things going. Okay. In the egg mixture, they add a little bit of hot sauce, uh -huh, right, just to liven uh -huh. things up. But here's where it gets real, and this is where Nashville chicken comes from. This is cayenne pepper, chili powder, onion, garlic, and a couple of other spices. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna take about a half a cup of this now cayenne pepper infused cooking oil, okay. and you're gonna make the most incredible glaze. And watch what happens to the color of this chicken. Guys, this has been a dish famous in Nashville for the last, I don't know, 60, 70, 80 years, and now everybody has decided to jump on the bandwagon oh. because it's tasty, it's got that right fire and heat, it's easy to make, it's fun to impress your friends, and I gotta tell you, ain't nobody wants to spend $12.95 on no, this look at when you that. got the tools at home to make it yourself. And that's How about what we're that talking on about. Game day or something. This is fantastic. If you're Love just it. joining us, welcome in the lunch rush. We are smack dab in the middle of showing you our today's special. So it's our best value of the whole day from Kitchen HQ, which by the way is a proprietary brand here exclusive Absolutely. to HSN. We took your requests, your needs in the kitchen, and created the tools that you need to cook like a pro, feel like a pro, but not have to baby the pan that we exactly. have here. And so I'm going to show you the colors we have available. Well, this is a non-stick, dishwasher-safe, cast-iron fry pan. It is 10 inches for you. We've got teal. We have taupe here right next to it. There's black, blue. Love the coral. We have a gorgeous plum. It also comes in silver, red, and rose. And in addition to that pan, something brand new for us and really exciting is the trivet. It's made of beech wood. Thing. This is going to protect your countertop surfaces, obviously, from your hot pan. But the beauty of this one is that it's magnetic. So, I mean, you legitimately can have your food here and set it down right on the table. It becomes a part of the decor with these great colorways, but you're protecting your surface. I just think that's such a genius idea. And again, you can bake with these. You can put them in the dishwasher. They are safe for you to do that. Uh, also, any cooktop, right? I mean, we have used a glass yes, top. Glass, We've got induction. Induction or electric makes no Fantastic. difference at all. Okay. So have a look here. Look at the colors. Look at the shrimp. They're just perfect. Again, this is why people love, love, love cooking with cast iron. So here's a really cool way to make a dish like this pretty. You're going to take a little bit of ricotta cheese mm. and you're just going to go ahead. What I love to do with this is make as many dabs as people I have over for dinner. So if I've got four, I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to make four little piles here. I'm not okay. going to mix it all up because it's a really nice, refreshing dish when they can scoop out their own little pile there with their own little dab and take that, uh, you know, onto their plate. But what's cool is, watch this. Here's that trivet we keep talking about. And I'm just going to go ahead and hold way. this one. This is wood and it's magnetized. And it's one-handed... There it is. Done. So now I can, <laughs> I can bring this to the table. I can enjoy this meal that I spent a little bit of time on, not for me, 
But for the people that I've got over at my house, uh, you know, at Thanksgiving or at Christmas, and I want to be able to celebrate that. I want to be able to celebrate the steak. I want to be able to celebrate dessert. Mm -hmm. And I can't do it if it's stuck in the kitchen. Yeah. That trivet lets me bring it right out. And watch this salmon here. I love now, this. Now, remember, we did the salmon. We did skin side down as well. And that, again, right. would be another no-no when you're comparing do that to traditional <laughs> cast don't iron. Don't do it. And again. You don't have to worry with a non-stick that you'll never have to season either. Right. And that's why you buy non-stick. So you can do dishes like this. The problem Ooh. with your non-stick Look at this. Look I don't know how this is coming across on your TV, but with me standing in front of this, there is a texture and a thickness uh. to this sear that you cannot get with anything but cast iron. I'm telling you right now, it's not a Look. it's not a guess, it's just a fact. And, and not that one skin, piece of that broke off. Isn't that beautiful? Now watch wow. this. That Here's the fantastic. other problem with, uh, with cast iron, you ready? Okay. If I were to put citrus in a pan that you spent a whole bunch of time seasoning, guess what? You gotta you season it again. It. You're not invited over anymore. You're not after invited that. over. <laughs> that means that after I cook my meal, I have to go ahead and cook my pan. And I don't know about you, but to me, that's ludicrous. <laughs> you know, so Mark, how does our nonstick compare to, to like, let's say the enamel coated sure. cast iron? Because those enamel are expensive, coated, but I've, I've seen right. them chip before. And, you know, enamel it's not coated pretty. cast iron is a very, again, thick enamel coating. That's how it works, okay? Mm -hmm. And what that does for you is it allows something called a release point, all right? It's a little more forgiving than straight cast iron, but the bottom line is it still is not the tool for a beginner, yeah. right? And what I love about this pan is it's the great equalizer. It doesn't matter if you've got paperwork on the wall, fancy blue coat, or if you've just got the pan showing up at home because you saw it here on TV <laughs> and you want to be able to do some fun stuff like this family-sized chicken pot pie. You want to see the coolest Look thing here? That. Watch this. Now, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to, you know, take a bit of cream soup, whatever you love. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and take some fried chicken. That's where that chicken came from, but I'm going to save the skin. Okay. And now I'm going to go ahead and put a dollop of whatever my favorite biscuit mix is. One dollop for every single guest that I have. So again, I'm just going to do four. This is a big enough pan at 10 inches that you could do five, you could do six without any problem at all. Okay. And then the skin that you saved from the fried chicken, watch this. Every piece oh, gets a little dollop, just like that. That's gonna crisp up in about 10 minutes in the oven, and you know how long to cook it, because uh -huh. the instructions on the box said how long to cook those biscuits for. Yes. That's all you do. And you could just take it straight to the exactly. oven. Exactly, 500, 550 degrees, and it doesn't matter how you get there. It doesn't matter if it's a broiler, it doesn't matter if it's a grill, I don't care if you hold a lighter under it. 500, 550 degrees, yeah. and when you talk about even cooking, Ouch! That hurts. This is even wow. cooking. Look at that, you guys. Look That's at about that. as special I'm as it gets. By that. <laughs> now, in our last show, and then I'm going to put this burger together, and okay. you've got to see this. Okay. Guys, this was a happy accident. This almost never happens, okay. but I did save it. This is not one of our normal demos. We burnt the holy heck out of one what of those chicken pot pies that we put in. And in any other pan, any other cast iron pan, you would just throw that it's away, done. The whole thing. But I saved it because you got to see this. Guys, Look that's at what this. a burnt cast iron pan from Kitchen HQ looks like, a lot like a fresh one. You can't hurt these <laughs> pans even when you burn something that bad in the oven. Are you oh kidding? Oh my gosh, our <laughs> producer said, now you got a frisbee to play with too out of that. I love it. It's a beautiful thing, everybody. It's a $76 value because included with this beautiful pan is the trivet. It's wood, it's magnetized. It's a really easy way to honestly have one dish start to finish. You could start exactly. here, end up in the oven, get it with the trivet, put it right to the table. The colors make it a really fun addition, a pop of personality. Absolutely. But the point of the matter is this is all that you love about cast iron and zero of the extra effort and the worry. You don't have exactly. to season this ever. ever. It is non-stick. You can put it in the dishwasher. You can put it into the oven as well. No chipping, risk of rusting it. It's just taking it into modern times. Exactly. You know? It takes everything you love about your non-stick cookware, all the reasons you bought it in the first place, and it marries them with every single reason you gave up cast iron because it's difficult to use and care for and yeah. learn. You know what? Everything you love about that nonstick and everything you love about cast iron is all in one place. So just wow. here for the last couple of seconds, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to let this finish melting. By the way, if you're wondering what I'm doing here, I'm actually going to make caramel in a cast iron pan. That's reserved for special pans made of copper, things like that, uh -huh. because of the properties that are associated with it. But in the meantime, let me go ahead and make one of the most viewed recipes on our cooking channel online, and that's our Black Angus 
pastrami. Oh, the crusty, yummy pork belly burger. Goodness on Here that. we go. Oh yeah, the the the, the sear that you get uh -huh. from cast iron isn't like anything you've ever you know, seen. And Let's that's go ahead. Even better than a barbecue, oh, uh, honestly. Man. And when it gets cold out, and you can't get outside, and you don't want the that's fat it. dripping down and flaming up on your burger. That's it. Think about being able to use this cast iron. That is a mammoth of a burger that right there. That is the real deal burger. You got to try that, you wow. guys. And you know what's more impressive than the burger? Watch this. <laughs> this is the best part right here. It doesn't matter what you love to cook. It doesn't matter your cooking style. What does matter is that the cleanup is mm -hmm. simple, and that is simple cleanup. And, and if you missed it ready. earlier, too, you can use any type of cooktop. Could be gas, glass, induction, or oven electric, safe, yeah. dishwasher safe, electric is fine, too, with this. I just want to keep reiterating that because it's kind of unheard of exactly. in the world of cast iron. Exactly. I'm really happy we can offer something like this. And here's this. something else that's unheard of. Guys, these utensils that I've been using this whole time are really special because because for a silicone utensil, these are rated to 400 degrees. And you might be thinking to yourself, well, big deal, 400 degrees I got out on the grill. But you yep. gotta remember your grill has open spaces, your stove top doesn't. So to be able to handle 400 degrees uh -huh. on a stove top while you're making caramel tower apples for your next Halloween event, I gotta tell you guys, it's a special thing. And I'm gonna go ahead, whoop, and glue that there. Oh, and that my there. goodness. And we're just gonna keep this piling up throughout the day. We're going to see how high we can get this yes. by the end of the <laughs> by day. By the end of the day. I love Listen, it. Listen, if you want to take advantage of this, our price point is only good until midnight. That's what makes it a today special. You have your choice of colors. It's 10 inch non-stick. You'll never season it. It goes straight into the dishwasher. You can put it into the oven. Any cooktop will work. And included with that pan is the wooden trivet that is magnetized so it stays with you on the pan so you can take it right to the table. And All look of at how that. Is. And look at that non-stick <laughs> difference there. Love My it. goodness. $13 and change on a flex payment. We'll get it home for you now. And don't forget, we're in our extended holiday return period. So if you're getting Absolutely. this for someone else or you want to try it out for a few months, you have till the end of January next year Absolutely. to send it back. Now, you mentioned the utensils, and yeah. I do want to touch on that yeah, for just a couple of minutes. Front, actually, we have this great set. It's a six-piece set. Yeah, and what's 